this guy, Nordenstrom from Sweden, he was the professor of radiology at uh, Karolinska Institute, I believe, and he died, I think, around the year 2007, but in 1983 wrote this book, and how it came about was, and by the way, there's a YouTube of him from when he was fairly young describing these things. He noticed, if he's touching hundreds and hundreds of films every day of, of lung cancer, which was his specialty, he noticed that there was a corona, a corona structure like the corona around the sun, around those uh, tumors and then later he experimented to make sure that they weren't also found in benign and they were not so there's something about the cancer and then that one happens to be from breast cancer uh, he went from his discovery like what is this and by the way his um, set of bibliographical references does not mention cryo was working on something similar and also I noticed in the beautiful book by Becker, not Beck, but Becker, Robert O. Becker, which is called The Body Electric, he didn't seem to know about this either. Isn't that amazing? He was working in Syracuse, New York. This guy was working in Stockholm and Cryle predated both of those men by 50 more years. He was working in Ohio. But you think through the magic of the you know, the journals that they catch up with each other, but they didn't. But each of them was catching up with writings of the 19th, 18th century, and some of them even went back to use Faraday. I mean, we're talking basic. And anyway, this man, when he wraps up his work, this is Nordenstrom, says, Nearly the entire content of this book serves one main purpose, to focus attention on the existence and function of an important biological principle, the biologically closed electric circuit. To accept this concept will re require reviewing actual data in order to overcome an abundance of possible objections. The consequence of the concept appears manif consequences appear manifold and useful. Therefore, they merit some closing consideration. You want to get that book. That's all I have to say.